these Hawks. They're very exciting. Are you confident for tonight? Clint Capella said that he's going to send the Knicks. He and the Hawks are going to send the Knicks on an early vacation, which seems like a nice thing. If anyone else offers you an early vacation, you would be cool with it, right? I think anytime you get to uh, be away from James Dolan, it's considered a vacation. <laughs> right. Um, I'm not, you know, I'm an Atlanta fan, so a three-one <laughs> lead doesn't mean anything to me. Yeah. I'm never, I'm never confident. I'm, I'm just excited to watch the team. There's so much negativity out there these days. People are mad mm -hmm. about sports. Athletes are mad at the media and everything. And look at this, a an Atlanta sports fan just living in the now, enjoying <laughs> what you can get. Can you counsel mm -hmm. any other long-suffering <laughs> fans in Atlanta? Yeah, I mean, we haven't won a championship of anything since like 95 mm -hmm. um and uh so i mean i just have learned i guess over the years to celebrate the wins and forget the losses because you just have to have amnesia uh with the hawks like they're kind of like my third team like they they kind of like i'm more of like an nba playoffs fan because i feel like that in and in, in the nba there's so few stakes to me because so many of the teams make the playoffs i I always used to say that like a full watching a full NBA game is like sex. It's like, I like nothing good happens into the last two minutes and you're just like, hurry up and shoot. You know what I mean? Like, I don't understand why it's taking so long. Like nobody even tries into the end. So, I mean, but I don't want to get team, personal, but the last two minutes for me is also the first two minutes. So I'm trying to figure out how that I'm trying to negotiate in my head. How that, okay. <laughs>